Hey YouTube, I'm Alan, and welcome to episode 44 of my Mass Effect Let's Play. And let's get going. Finish Pharos finally. And sorry for the delays, my computer was being a pain yesterday, or else I would have had two of them up late last night, but still last night. Anyways, here we go. And I uploaded a League of Legends video that's actually up, both parts. So I should put that in the annotations to 41, or 42 and 43, and this one, when this one finally uploads. But, yeah. Oh look, clone. Come here. Come here. No. God, this reloads so fast. Man. I can like always have overpowered. Get up, Rex. Targets down. Thank you. Hello. What the heck? So, what happens if I die in the middle of a cutscene? Anyways, it's falling. It's a half hour long boss fight over. Not quite. So, I guess she came out of that? Yep. It didn't show it exploding. I'm free. I. I suppose I should thank you for releasing me. How do I know this isn't some kind of trick? Well, this it did no just trick. fall. The Thorian is dead, and I am myself again. My name is Shiala. That purple clashes I with served, that green. Is that just me? I served Matriarch Benezia. When she allied herself with Saren, so did I. Benezia foresaw the green. influence Saren would have. She joined him to guide him down a gentler path. But Saren is compelling. Benezia lost her way. You chose to side with Saren. So did Matriarch Benezia. Benezia underestimated Saren, as I did. We came to believe in his cause and his goals. The this strength of his familiar. influence is troubling. Of course, you she guys tried to heard manipulate it Saren, but in the end, her plan backfired. Asari matriarchs are among the most intelligent and powerful beings in the galaxy. How could one fall under Saren's control? Saren has a vessel. An enormous warship unlike vessel, anything I've huh? ever seen. You sure it's not a vessel? He calls it Sovereign. It can dominate the minds Sovereign. of his followers. They become indoctrinated to Saren's will. The process is subtle. It can take days, weeks. That's but not in the that end, long, actually. It is I would think months. I was a willing slave when Years Saren brought me to this world. He needed my biotics to communicate with the Thorian to learn its secrets. How do you communicate Saren offered using me biotics? In trade. That doesn't make sense. I was sacrificed to secure an alliance between Saren and the Thorian. That's what you get for trusting Saren. These renegade options Saren aren't actually jerky options. Saren is to betray oh, his followers anyway. and his allies. Once he had what he needed, he ordered his geth to destroy the Thorian. That worked really well. Saren knows you are searching for the conduit. He knows you are following his steps. He attacked the Thorian so you could not gain the cipher. What's the cipher? And why did Saren need it? You'd the think you'd be a little more Prime excited about that. Visions, but the visions are unclear, confusing. They were meant for a Prothean mind. To truly comprehend them, you must think like a Prothean. You must understand their culture, their history, their very existence. I would think thinking like the a Prothean would be a lot more subtle than that. The built this city. Like literally thinking the same way, having when the same died, thought processes. Them. Your mind works the same way. It doesn't have the same background. There, that's a big difference. That would be important in interpreting what you saw, but it wouldn't be important in actually seeing it. Just give me some plain answers. Where is the cipher? 
The cipher is the very essence of being a Prothean. It cannot be described or explained. That's a better explanation. It would be ironically. like describing color to a creature without eyes. To understand, you must have access to endemic ancestral memory. And there a they go again. Spanning thousands of Prothean generations. I sense this ancestral memory, the cipher. When I meld it with the Thorian, our sense. identities merge, our it minds would... intertwined. Such knowledge cannot be taught. It simply exists. You taught Saren, you can teach me. There is a way. I can transfer the knowledge from my mind to yours, as I did with Saren. Isn't that last part what I was just Try saying? Try to relax, Commander. Slow, deep breaths. Let go of your physical shell. Reach out to grasp the threads that bind us, one to another. Every action sends ripples across the galaxy. Every idea must touch another mind to live. Each emotion must mark another's spirit. You know, we sounds kind of like connected. the idea behind the Force. Wow, is she Every taller than I am? Every living being united in a single glorious That sounds a lot existence. like the Force. Open yourself to the universe, Commander. Embrace eternity. This... I hope no one goes into seizures. Yeah. A lot of this looks really realistic, actually. Kind of gross. And then you get this, which I never really figured out what was called this part here. Like, what are those planets? I, I have no idea. Like, I guess they could be the planet that you guys go to. I know what that is. Yeah, that still doesn't make any sense, lady. I have given you the cipher. Just and as it was given to Saren. The ancestral memories of the Protheans are part of you now. Are you alright? What just happened? I saw something. Whoa. It still Dude. didn't make any Dude. sense. That head looked you like it went too gift. far around. The experience of an entire people. It will take time for your mind to process this information. We should get you back to the ship, Commander. Medical needs to know about this. Okay. I'm sorry if you have suffered, but there was no other way. You needed the cipher. In time, it will help you understand the vision from the beacon. Tell me more so about this ship. So much stuff to talk about. Yes. It's been a long time Sovereign since I've had a decent alien. dialogue. I wheel. do not know how it was built or where it comes from. Its design does not match that of any known spacefaring species. It dwarfs any vessel in the Citadel or Alliance fleets. Its weapons are devastating. Its defenses virtually impenetrable. With it, Saren believes he is unstoppable. You said Saren uses it to manipulate his followers. The indoctrination. There is an energy about Sovereign. You feel drawn to the ship. It makes Saren's arguments more persuasive, more compelling. Spend enough time in Sovereign's presence and you will lose yourself. There is no other way to explain it. Okay, that's about the matriarch, right? I want to know more about Benezia. So. Benezia was greatly respected among our people. A powerful biotic, even for an Asari. She was widely known as a teacher of philosophy Religion, I missed religion. that part. She always sought the of course, religion and philosophy are pretty harmony. close to Asari. She joined if the I remember correctly, actually quite a few of them became Buddhist. Instead, she became one of his most powerful allies. As I mentioned before, Matriarch Benezia underestimated Saren. Be sure you do not make the same mistake. What else can you tell me about Saren? There is little I could tell you that you do not already know. He's powerful, he's charismatic. And he is dangerous. Once I followed him, blind to his true nature. But now I see he's leading the galaxy into an age of darkness and suffering. I suppose mind control the Thorian kind of overpowers that. Is there that, anything else uh, you can tell um, me about the Thorian? Not that it matters now, but it kind of overpowered me, that I Sovereign, I guess. Part of it, but I still or don't kind of truly off. understand it. So alien, so ancient. Its exact age is impossible to know. It measured time differently. 10,000 years of hibernation broken by a few frantic centuries of activity. Frantic centuries. Its mind was awesome, magnificent. It transcended all classification. And now it is gone. 
The galaxy's a better place with that thing dead and gone. The Thorin was a unique life form. A sentient being that lived for 50,000 years, maybe more. There is nothing even remotely like it in the known but galaxy. But you've discovered anywhere. I'm grateful you saved me from a life of thraldom. Yet I cannot help but feel some sorrow for the thrall. loss of such it was a just rare and remarkable DNA. creature. You were allied with Saren. For all I know, oh, you still are. Sharp discontinuity. I, I have to suddenly continue Your the conversation after talking a lot. But you freed me from the story. Someone needs to figure that out. Saren. These kinds of I am games. on your side now. That was a huge. Emphasis. If you allow it, I would like to stay here with the colonists. They have suffered greatly, and I played a role in their if suffering. If you heard that, that was actually a message like from make um, League of Legends, which is still up because I forgot to put it down. Anyways, um. You yeah. change sides too often. I have no choice. You must die. You can say it nicer than that. So be like actually sound regretful. If this is the fate you feel I deserve, then I will not resist. To be fair, if you think about it, she was good. Then she was Saren's. Then she was the Thorians. Yeah. I can't believe it. I. Uh, there's John a says we'll have all the there. money we need to keep this place running. It's because of you, Shepard. I can't thank you enough. Awesome. Level up. Didn't I level up? Didn't I just... Wow, six? Holy... That's a lot. Um... Um, assault rifles? I can do assault rifles. I suck with assault rifles. Advanced community, master overload, advanced stamping. Yeah, I think we'll do that. Rex has three points. That I get to go in a. Nah. Uh, shotguns, no. Because he can actually get to advanced overkill. And Garrus gets to max electronics. And. Work on sniper rifles. They get so many less points than I do, it's ridiculous. Thank you so much. Now Exogeny will pour the money in. We'll be able to rebuild and then... Where's that... shop, dude? All traces of the Thorian will be erased in short order. Better for have a second chance thanks to you. Well, thanks again. The data will be very valuable once I get out I'm pretty sure the... I fought so hard, but any thought of my own caused so much pain. Yeah, if you remember that dude that was in the, um... Uh, tunnels? Ah, he's there. That dude that was in the tunnels, he was under the control of the Thorian, but he was, uh, he basically passed his will save halfway, and, uh, he, he kind of made him go crazy, because he was, his will was powerful enough to resist it, but it was still chemically inducing him to do it, he could just I never fight thought I would pain. be so thrilled to see a soldier. Forgive my previous inaction, but under the Thorian's influence, every thought was examined and filtered. What will you do now that the fight Yay, is over? Yay, inventory. I, I haven't stay. messed with this the entire game. And I managed I not to have to delete everything. I went through the entire planet Perhaps only gained 150 stuff. After all. Thanks. Let me see what you have in stock. Of course. Return in the future. I probably I should have given have myself stuff first. So yes, I'm going to end the game on... End this... Not the end the game, but end the... Uh, uh, video. Oh, no wonder. Why am I using a Lancer? Oh my god. But I'm going to end the video on this. Yeah, sure. More damage. Always better. Okay, that works. Okay, I've been keeping up with that. It is nothing better. Nope, nothing better. Um, no, I think I'm good. You really need some some different armor, Rex. Sorry. Um. Yeah, you can use that. And you get a better shotgun. Oh, you get a much better shotgun. Yeah, you can have that one. <laughs> get a better assault rifle after I give Garrus his tsunami.
Tsunamis are awesome. And the accuracy rating actually goes up, so that's good. <laughs> Armor piercing rounds one, so cute. Um, tungsten. Oh, whoops. Uh, that's enough for this episode. Thank you for watching. Um, I'll probably finish that off save. But thank you for watching. Like it if you liked it. Comment if you have anything to say. This video is over 15 and a half minutes, but it doesn't matter. I'm happy. Anyways, all that awesome stuff. And thanks for uh, bearing with me through all of this mess. Um, see you tomorrow.